Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Arnold Palmer. Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much for that, and uh, it's a great pleasure to be here. And when Ed and Russ Meyer asked me if uh, I would do these ads, I agreed very quickly uh, because aviation has been a part of my life and is still a part of my life. I learned to fly 52 years ago in a 175, 182. I soloed in eight hours, and I was pretty proud of myself, never thinking what was going to come from what I was doing. I started because I was scared of flying. I had flown with some people that were not as aware of how people might receive flying and how an airplane might scare people. I remember flying in a DC-3, C-47, from Pittsburgh to St. Louis one day, and I was 16 years old. And we were hitting some thunderstorms, and I was sitting on the left side of the airplane, and I remember bumping around, and I more bumped around, the more scared I got, and finally I saw a ball of fire come down the middle of the aisle. Yeah. And I didn't have any idea what was happening. I thought it was all over. Well, as all of you know, in those days, a little static electricity was in that airplane, and that's when I decided that I really needed to know about aviation. So, 52 years ago, I got to know about it. Cirrus Design's Vision SJ50 single-engine personal jet offers exceptional fuel efficiency, flexible seating for up to seven, advanced avionics, and all the Cirrus safety features you expect, including the Cirrus airframe parachute system. With its V-tail design, the Cirrus Vision is technologically advanced, yet engineered to be simple to fly, to allow owner pilots more lifestyle pursuits than any other personal aircraft. Learn more about the Vision SJ-50 at cirrusdesign.com. And as I've flown the various airplanes through my life, I enjoy setting in my Citation 10 in the left seat. And what did it do for me? It gave me a competitive edge in golf and in business. And that is something that I can't tell you how much it has meant to me through the years. And I can also tell you that well, I got upset when I heard the people in Washington bashing business airplanes. And I think probably all of you got a little bit upset about that, too. And it was something to hear companies had cut the use of their airplanes because of that unfair criticism. Now, that's just crazy. Using business airplanes, especially in this tough economy, it doesn't make sense not to use your airplanes, not to get to where you have to be, and not to be effective. You have to use the tools that are necessary to do your job. I have been flying around the world in my airplane most of my life to play and do my business. Play golf, yes, but to do my business. I know how important that airplane is, not just to me, but to my hometown, to the people in this country, and to all of you. And without it, as I say, <laughs> I wouldn't be here. If you own a Cirrus today or if you're considering the purchase of a new or used aircraft, consider this. Avidyne, in conjunction with the country's leading Cirrus sales and maintenance facilities, has launched the G3R9 program that combines the purchase of a late model, low time Cirrus aircraft and the addition of the Avidyne Integra Release 9 avionics suite for much less than you may have thought, and certainly much less than purchasing a brand new aircraft. G3R9, combining the best airframe, best engine, and best avionics for the best value. 
Business aviation is one of the greatest of the American industry. It creates jobs. It goes places where airlines do not go. It enables companies, large and small, to be more productive and efficient. So I hope all of you will do everything you can to support this campaign. I think this campaign is something that each and every one of you, pilots, businessmen, housewives, whatever, will get behind and work. And let's be more offensive, not so defensive of business aviation. Let's tell the world that we are very positive about what we do when we fly our airplanes to our business meetings, and in my case, even to the golf course. I'm proud of these ads that Ed and Russ have put together, and I support them 100 percent. But I can't do it by myself, nor can Russ or Ed or any of the speakers that you have heard here today. But you people, you business people, you pilots, you people in this audience need to speak up and speak positively. I can tell you that in my over 52 years of flying, one of the greatest thrills I have is getting in my airplane. And I think about when I have a bad round of golf, and I'm pretty upset about it. The nicest thing that happens to me is when I get in that airplane and go to a, another job, and I forget the bad round of golf I hit. Thank you very much. <laughs>